We'll try to be brief. The idea is to present something that the group of our community does in uh, the ICON environment during the presentation. This is just a, let me tell you that we are in the SOC. Um, in the committee, we are with Jorge Villa, Lescano, and myself representing our community. The Address Council is a support organization within under ICANN that deals with numbers and uh, internet resources. What do what should I do? Sing? Don't worry. Lunch is not there yet. Don't leave. Well, uh, so as I said, as I see, is one of the support organization for numbers. ASOAC is basically what would we do, who we are. I won't give you the details. This is public. And uh, the important thing here is to mention how we are organized. There's 15 of us. Now we are not uh, 15 here, but there are three for each IRR, two uh, selected by the community and one appointed by the IRR, by the board of the IRR of the members uh, uh, region. And uh, the role, uh, the, it lasts depending on the IRR. In most cases, there, it's two years. And here, why? Did I say that today we are not uh, 15 because we have a very concerning situation in Africa. We uh, have a Saul Stein that uh, is Saul Stein whose uh, mandate finishes now in December 2023. And in the other regions, uh, uh, APNIC, Arian LACNIC, and RIPE NCC. In our region, LACNIC, we have Esteban Escana, myself, and Jorge today. This year, I'm the vice chair. And the chair is Hervé Clermont of RIPE NCC. And let me state that in the APNIC, DIMA is the person whose mandate is about to be completed in December. But we had an APNIC meeting where the, they repeated him for another term. And the same thing happens with uh, Hervé, who will also continue in his role, even though he his mandate would finish in December. We have a group that is formed uh, in the ASO AC, that there are people that are paying attention to proposals for global policy that arise there in the policy forum, defining the people in the group of these 15 or less that are going to be, be paying attention to this. And those are the people that are part of this uh, policy proposal facilitator team. Uh, Jorge is the person. Uh, that is um, in charge of this in this from representing our group. So that gives you some information of what we're doing, what we've already done. We had an an in-person meeting in Icon Cancun in March, and we just come from uh, another in-person meeting in Kyoto during APNIC 56. There you have a discussion list. It's an open list where we debate the topics of work and even calls for positions. The uh, monthly um, uh, telecom set with teleconferences, uh, video conferences, we publish the time and the dates and uh, people are invited to participate. Now, Jorge, yes? Well, of all the roles by our group, we have the possibility of um, putting 
are two people, nine and ten, of ICANN. Nine is by Alan Barrett and uh, Christian Kaufmann is number ten. So we indicate a person, um, Fernanda Silva, who was just uh, chosen for that. So we have the people that were selected for responsibility positions in the ICON community now. And what else have we done? Well, because of different uh, reasons uh, in our group, we had to revisit many of the procedures that were already in force because as happens in uh, the policy, there are many things that are defined at a certain time under certain conditions, and when the con once the conditions change, sometimes the pre written procedures are no longer applicable, so some adjustments are required. And that's what we've been doing for some time. We've uh, discussed this for almost a year, and we have drafted many recommendations. As a matter of fact, Esteban Liscano was one of the people who promoted this work, and Ricardo, too, has been very active. So I think that now we completed the final version in Kyoto, and it's pending ratification by the NROC. So in theory, with that, we would be completing our work. Finally, I wanted to tell you that the nomination period is already open for position nine of the ICON board. If those of you who are in uh, the uh, mailing list for the announcements of LACNIC, you may have received that note. The period started on September the 15th, and it will finish on December 15th. I think it would be worth having people in our community to uh, apply for that uh, call. It's very important to have people in our community as members of the board of ICANN and not only would that increase the diversity in the board, but I think that it would really strengthen uh, our work and it would enhance uh, the outlook of our region on all this. So I hope that if you consider suitable for this uh, position, please consider it and uh, notice that the period of nominations will be open until December 15th. I think this is everything we had to say. So I won't torment you any further. Just invite you for lunch. Ricardo's paying. 